with the permission of her husband, is it allowed to limit the number of children? It's permissible for them in both if they agree to delay having more children to want to have to have you know uh, no more children you know for now yeah, it's something permissible but in general to have more children is rewarded the prophet sallallahu alaihi he said tanakahu takatharu you know, get married to you know, multiply your wives multiply your children i'll be proud of you on the day of judgment of the big numbers of my ummah so you know to have more children is good is better now that does need to include taking consideration for the health and the, um, you know, the, con the concern for the wife because you know, a woman may not be able to have as many children as uh, her husband wants. Sure. You know, he, he can't demand on her something that's going to harm her or to be difficult for her. But I mean, it's what some of the ulama said is 20 is a good 20, number for one wife. If you have four wives, that's yeah. 80. You know? okay. This yeah, is the maximum. Okay, that's uh, 80 reasons that, you know, Islam is uh, growing. Uh, 40 times more than any other religion. And it's not because they're evangelizing, making spirit children, you know, people being born again and really becoming converted to what it is they believe. They're just literally having so many kids. Um, and then the next part of their evangelism is that they just intimidate everyone into becoming a Muslim and killing off the rest and so here's some uh, scriptures as you can read here 10 violent verses from the Quran fight against those who do not obey and do not believe in or the last day well we're in the last days <laughs> I definitely believe that but I don't believe in this clown and do not forbid what has been forbidden by and his messenger it's funny that it mentions Jesus ten times more than it does uh, Muhammad but anyhow even if they are of the people of the book until they pay and they're talking about the Bible there Jizya that's a tax with willing submission and feel themselves subdued so if, if you want uh, <coughs> Islam in your local community understand you'll have to pay a tax to um, the mosque just like the Catholics used to um, just like we used to pay a tax to the local Catholic Church before the, the nation became Protestant um, if you want your local community to, f to embrace Islam there's a Jizya tax associated with that Okay, just give you some time to read through this. Not that I agree with a lot of the Western customs myself, but I definitely don't agree with Islam. <laughs> uh, I definitely don't agree with a lot of the Eastern customs, so I just believe in the Word of God, the New Testament. <clears throat> when the sacred months have passed, then kill the mush, mush Rikin whatever you find a good name capture them besiege them lie in wait for them in each and every ambush but if they repent well, what's that according to them you know and perform the prayers what do you mean like uh, the sinner's prayer I somehow doubt that and give zakat then leave their way free so if you are worried about street preachers in your local city understand that as Islam grows, um, Muslims will start, very obedient Muslims will start obeying the Quran and you'll get this. Literally um, capturing people, besieging people, breaking into properties, lying in wait for people, assaulting people, especially women that don't wear hijabs, and so on. Okay? Give you some time to read through this just normal normal Muslim stuff standard variety next one they ask you about fighting during the sacred months tell them fighting therein is a great sin but a greater sin is to prevent mankind from um, falling the way of uh, to disbelieve in him very interesting 
So I, I suppose that's Ramadan when they fast, but they don't even they don't even do proper fasts. <clears throat> Apparently they sort of don't eat during the day, but they'll snack snack at night time. It's not really proper fasting. Like when Jesus fasted, they didn't eat, and questionably, we don't even know if he actually drunk anything for forty days, which I know is. Uh, probably humanly impossible, you can't really go for more than about four days without water. But Moses went without um, food or water, 40 days and nights in Mount Sinai, so uh, that's real fasting, by the way. <laughs> Alright. Kill them whenever you find them and drive them out from where they drove you out. Uh, as far as I know, Muslims have never actually dwelled in any part of Europe for any amount of time. Maybe Turkey um, towards that area, but as far as I know, they don't have a right to persecute or drive out anyone. But but they will, you know, because as they move into your neighbourhood. Maybe they will take 20 wives or 5 wives or 2 wives uh, and just literally take over the entire neighbourhood and then maybe even take your own wife while they're at it. When you meet the unbelievers, smite their necks. Very nice. Standard procedure for Islam. Even just just moderate Islam is 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 just uh, believing believing their own holy book, you know. Just that's that's what they're commanded to do. When your Lord revealed to the angels, truly I am with you. So keep firm. Those who have believed, I will strike terror into the hearts of those who have disbelieved. Really, so strike them up their necks and cut off their fingers. Very charming, I would say. Uh, well, Metallica used the lyrics to the other one. I'm not sure about that. Men are the protectors and the maintainers of women because it has made one superior to the other and because they spend to support them from their means. Therefore, righteous women are obedient. They guard in the husband's absence what it orders them to guard. And to those women from whom you fear disobedience, give them a warning, send them separate beds and beat them just standard stuff they even really know what it was about just beat beat the wife as a command they even know what for but yeah um yeah wear black bags on their head that'll be that's just normal next one all you who believe Fight those of the disbelievers who are close to you and let them find harshness in you. Harshness. Just just reflecting their, their God, you know, the character of their God. Harsh, brutal, um, merciless, I would say. Violent, and the list goes on. Blah, 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 blah. Muhammad is the apostle of blah. Those who follow him are merciful to one another, but harsh to the disbeliever. Well, they've just contradicted just about what that verse says. I mean, if they're beating up their wives and everybody else around them, um, and literally trying to conform everything and everyone around them to their ideals, it's just not a peaceful religion, is it? Um, you know, it's peaceful if you, you do what a, a Muslim asks you to do. Go and jump off a cliff go and say this word that you don't even understand in Arabic uh, worship a god that's in the Kaaba which is a, an idol, a black stone you know that's 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 who that this is, it's an idol that's why I don't see it it's not, a, it's not a real god you know I mean there used to be a band I think it was in Norway or Sweden called Aha you know so maybe I'll just call, call them Aha you know that <laughs> it, was a, it was a music group back in the 80s so I think that's what we'll call their god um, blah 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 more, more normality from Islam 
They wish you that you would reject faith as they have rejected faith unless that you would be all equal. So don't take protectors from them unless they immigrate in the way of aha. But if they turn back, then seize them and kill them whenever you find them. Just what reason? For turning the wrong way or I don't know. For saying, well, I don't want to really follow your crazy religion. Stab, death, blow themselves up. That's just standard for for Islam. Guys, wake up or die. It's time to wake up, guys. Wakey, wakey. Islam is not a peaceful religion. That, that's just ten. There's like dozens, dozens of, of scriptures like this in the Quran. I prefer to stick to the ones about Jesus Christ. I made videos on that, guys. So, yeah. Any questions?